Hi everyone, today I'm going to show you what I've done so far. The white hummingbird tree. So, even the sound of hummingbird is attractive to me. Um, anyway, uh, these particular trees, they are found in Southeast Asia and they are legume trees, so they're nitrogen fixing. Um, so if you're interested in permaculture and you want to know a you know, different type of legume tree that does the nitrogen fixing and is fast growing, this will be another type of plant that you might want to consider that will grow into a 8 meter tree in maybe 5 or 10 years time. Um, in the description, I might post that, you know, in the description box when I upload this video. Um, they say here it can reach 2 meters in 12 weeks. That's not the case with mine and also it, it will reach 8 meters in 3 years time. Now keep in mind I live in a warm temperate zone so maybe that's the reason why it's not doing so well. Um, I germinate these from seed. It took quite a while to actually germinate and I had quite a few failures. Um, I used the paper towel method. The seed rotted away so that wasn't viable. Eventually I soaked it overnight and um, I sow it direct into the soil and eventually yeah, it germinated and I see the, the seed, you know, fatten up and a green shoot coming out. So I have this for almost two years and it's only like maybe about a meter. Um, so it's not going to reach, you know, two meters in four weeks, I think they said here. Sorry, 12 weeks. Um, and uh, personally, for my parents said to me that, you know, we, we used to eat the flowers from this particular tree in like a soup base kind of thing. Um, they're most, mostly common in steamboat type of soup, so a combination thing. Um, personally, I don't know anything about cooking. Uh, I don't know much about it. And I haven't eaten this for a very, very, very long time. So I don't even know what it tastes like or smell like. But I'm happy to say that hopefully if these things work out and I get some flowers, I might do a demonstration on how to cook it. With, of course, some assistance because I won't attempt it by myself. Um, the other thing about this tree is that it's fast growing, it's nitrogen fixing, um, I would say it's low maintenance um, and the tree itself is a softwood type of tree and you can use the log to make I think cat mushroom, cat ear mushroom or something like that um, which is great I mean if you're in, into fungi, fungi. Um, so there you have it I have three here this one I germinate myself and it's only like you can see here and uh, it's only quite recently that I have this growing that I went to the shop and I found these two little babies so nearly 20 bucks for like one this high um, there you go and both of I mean all three they look like they're about to flower so which is great um i mean you can spend a few dollars and get the seed and get it going or you can buy from the shop almost like you know 40 bucks for two plants um i guess the process is what counts isn't it <laughs> so i got some more seed um after the successful germination of one <laughs> Uh, I'm gonna do some more germination if I can and uh, hopefully these will be successful or maybe the seed from these particular tree once they start to flower and I get those seed it might be better and you know the success rate um, will be much more um, much more than the ones that you get online because you never know it could be just like daddy seed that they send to you and it doesn't work that could happen as well right anyway so this is uh, the white hummingbird tree. If you like to give it a go, go for it. Uh, I'll see you next time and take care of yourself. Bye.